Hey everyone, today I'm doing a holiday party get ready with me video. I'm going to a holiday party tonight so I thought that this would be a fun video to film for you guys. And I said on Tuesday that this is a share the love week. So today's collab is with Cassie from Shades of Cassie and I've been a huge fan of her channel for a really long time. She makes amazing tutorials and reviews and I just love all of her videos. So if you aren't subscribed to her channel, make sure that you go and subscribe and I will put a link to her video down below as well. And you should also follow her on Instagram because she puts up pictures of her son and he is so, so cute. I always love when she puts up pictures of him. But anyways, I guess that I will go ahead and get started. So starting off, I use my Spackle Tinted Makeup Primer in the color Bronze from Laura Geller and I like this because it helps my foundation last longer. And for foundation, I use the Luminous Silk Foundation from Giorgio Armani and I've had this foundation for a while and I don't wear it very often just because it has a little bit more coverage than I'm used to on a daily basis, but I really like this foundation a lot. It has really great coverage and it just has a really nice pretty finish as well. I use the Narcissist Foundation and Concealer Stick from Well People to conceal any blemishes or anything like that and I also use it on my under eye circles. I use my Laura Mercier Secret Brightening Powder to set my concealer. This has tiny light reflectors in it that helps to conceal dark circles which I really needed after my trip to New York this past weekend. For powder, I use the Elima Pure Satin Matte Mineral Powder in the color Beige 2. This has been my go-to recently. I really like this mineral foundation. To fill in my brows, I use my Maybelline Define a Brow Pencil in Medium Brown. And then I just combed it through using a comb brush. I used the Bahama Mama Bronzer from The Balm to contour, so I just applied this to my temples and right under my cheekbone and then along my jawline. I used my Trish McAvoy Eye Brightener Pencil in the color Shell to add highlights to my eyelid, so I applied this right in the middle, right under my brow, and then in the inner corner. And then I just blended it out with my finger. For eyeshadow, I'm using this quad from Chanel called Variation, and I got this. This is actually a tester that I had when I sold Chanel, so it doesn't look like a regular quad. It's one to fit inside of a unit, but I've never used this before, and I've had it for a long time, and I just recently found it. I forgot that I had it, so I wanted to use this, and I just put the first color all over my lid, and then this one I'm putting into my crease. And then I took the silver color and put that on the outer corner and just blended it in. And then I went back with the dark purple and applied that to the outer corner on my lower lash line using an angled brush. And then I went back with the Trish McAvoy Brightener Pencil and applied that to my waterline. For eyeliner, I used my Rimmel Exaggerate Waterproof Eye Definer, and I just did kind of a sloppy line on top because I knew I was going back with a liquid liner, but I just wanted to lay a base down before applying my false eyelashes. And then for liquid eyeliner, I used the Benico's Natural Liquid Liner, and I kind of just winged this out very, very slightly. For mascara, I use the Elima Pure Natural Definition Mascara. This is becoming one of my favorite natural mascaras. It gives a lot of length and also a lot of definition, and I really like it a lot. But I just applied this to my top lashes. I'm not doing my bottom lashes yet because I'm still going to do a little bit of product along my lower lash line. I wanted to use some natural looking false lashes, so I used these from Ardell in the number 110.
And because this was a holiday look, I wanted to use a little bit of sparkle, so I used my Chanel Illusion D'Ombre, which is a cream shadow in the color Mirafique, and applied that to the outer corner of my lower lash line, and then I just took it along my eyeliner as well. So it just added a little bit of a silver sparkle, and I just really like this a lot. It's really festive without getting too glittery or over the top. And then I went back and applied mascara to my lower lashes. And that's it for the eyes. So for blush, I use my K.R. Weiss Cream Blush in the color Desired Glow. This has been one of my favorite products recently. The formula works really well and it blends really easily and I love the color. For lip liner, I use Rouge from Chanel. These aren't my favorite lip liners. I find that they're kind of dry, but I don't know if mine's just old and it needs to be thrown out because I've had it for a while, but it just was a little bit difficult to blend, but I used a brush on the opposite end to blend it out. The lipstick that I used was the Jouer lipstick in the color Simone, which is a really pretty bright red. And I love the formula of Jouer's lipsticks. They're very hydrating and creamy. So moving on to the way that I style my hair, I basically just curled it like I always do. And I think my curling iron is an inch and a half, I believe. But I just curled it away from my face and then I took the next strand and curled it towards my face. And I found that if I alternate doing the curls in different directions this way, it doesn't all clump together into one piece and it just looks more natural. I also start in the middle of the section and then curl towards the top and then I let the ends in so that way I don't have the ends sitting in the curling iron for too long. And then I pinned my hair up using a bobby pin. I just took a small section in the front and kind of twisted it a little bit because I found that that helps it hold it in place and then I just put a bobby pin in. And then for my outfit, I got my dress from Forever 21 and it was only $24, which I thought was pretty amazing. And I really like it, just I wanted something really simple and black and I really liked the detailing on the sleeves. My ankle boots are also from Forever 21 and my earrings are from Charlotte Russe. I got these a really, really long time ago and on my nails, I'm wearing Sarah from Zoya. Okay, so that is everything. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to go and check out Cassie's video and channel. I will have them both linked below. And if you like this video, then please give it a thumbs up. And I hope that you guys have a great day. I will see you next time. Bye!